Mazda M2 was a special division of the company, a boutique section of the brand to build low volume special cars. It was the idea to create an R&D center closer to the customers, a showroom to better dialogue with customers. M2 developed special versions of Mazda cars following the customer's feedback. Some of the M2 vehicles were almost prototypes and customers could interact with members of the development team. This public side of the team was innovative and interactive. You could enter a showroom full of prototypes and talk to the designers and engineers about your ideal car. If you were lucky, the next car would have some of the features that you suggested. If the engineers found them good enough to materialize into a real product. The M2 building was designed by King Okaru, the same designer as the 2022 Tokyo Olympic Stadium. At the first floor there was the dealership. At the second floor a cafe, auditorium and library. At the third and fourth floor the development team offices. All the M2 vehicles were sequentially numbered with a metal plate. The M2 division closed down in 1995 after Ford bought some, some Mazda shares in exchange for the end of the Mazda's other brands to keep Mazda afloat. M2 1001 Sport tuned version of the MX5 with 130 horsepower. Suspension upgrades, steep fan chassis, mechanical LSD with cooler, HKS exhaust, 4-point wall cage, 3-spoke racing steering wheel, aluminum shift knob and handbrake handle, dark blue paint, vintage mirrors, vintage dashboard, aluminum fuel cup, 15-inch Panasport wheels and rear spoilers. 300 cars were made. M2 1002 Comfort Focus version of the MX5. It had interiors made from wood and leather. Only 100 units were made. M2 1004 Full House High Roof Van version of the Autosum Review. M2 1005 Experimental Rally Prototype of the Master Familia. M2 1006 Cobraster, high powered version of the MX5 with Mazda Sentia V6 engine, a red 7 suspension and subframe, and a different hood with higher central power to house the bigger engine. M2 1008 Berlinetta, a coupe based on the MX5. Pop up headlights were replaced with glass over units. At the rear it had round headlights, it took inspiration from vintage Zagato or Ferrari. M2-1009, it was a small SUV. M2-1010, coupe and little pickup based on the Mazda Familia. M2-1011, last version of the Eunus Cosmo. Since this car was already the most luxury Mazda car, it is difficult to believe what they made to make it even more luxurious. M2-1012, luxury version of the Ethne MPV. M2-1014, off-road version of the Autosum AC-1. M2-1015, Autosum Alts 1 with styling upgrades, light tuning. M2-1015A, rally version of the Autosum AZ-1. M2-1015B, Autosum AZ-1 with detachable roof panels. M2-1019, sport tuned version of the Elno Espresso Mazda MS-3. M2-1020, sport-tuned version of the Mazda RX-7 with engine and aerodynamic upgrades, BBS wheels, racing seats, 
It never made into production, but it inspired later most poetry aware seven versions. M2 1023 Group A Valley version of the Master Familia, the Sweet Legal version. M2 1024 Camper version of the Mazda Bongo Friendly. M2 1026 Sport Valley version of the Mazda Lantis. M2 1028 Street Competition Truck Focus version of the MX5. It had 140 horsepower, the fastest MX5 made by M2 aside from the visit one. Only 300 cars were made. It is thought to be the most popular car made by M2. M2 1031 Elnus Wardser adapted for wheelchair users.